Hello, my name is Will Wright. I'm a freelance journalist and writer. You can find me at writeswords.com. That's W-R-I-G-H-T-S, W-O-R-D-S dot com. Now, there are movie lovers and there are movie lovers. In April, the 35th annual Minneapolis-St. Paul International Film Festival begins. Did I just hear like half of my audience just scurry away because they figure, oh gosh, film festivals. He, he's one of those folks who thinks too much about movies and just can't just sit down and enjoy them, even you know the bad ones. Well, maybe so, maybe not. But if you're, if you're still here uh, and you think about film festivals sometimes, how often do you wonder how the films that are shown there are chosen? It's a good question, and I can describe it from my perspective. For the last two years, I've served on one of the dozen or so selection committees for that international film festival. The Film Society sends us links that we click on so we can watch these films on the web. And after we've done that, then we press on a, a link or a button for Rate It, where we rate it along a, a star or number scale. And then we type up the reason, the rationale for that rating, whether it was good or good God. So that's basically it. When I write down my rationale or motivation for the rating, I rely on the fact that I studied film history at the University of Minnesota before I got my degree in communication studies. So I, I write down my assessment, whether it's good or good God, and there it lays. Now the biggest surprise I had in this process is when I learned that the director of programming doesn't watch all of the films. And it would be unreasonable for him to do that. I mean, the, the International Film Festival shows at least 120, 130, 140 films. So that means that at least four or 500 filmmakers submit their films for consideration. And for any one man to watch that many films, and halfway into it, if I was him, halfway into it, my, my taste for and love for movies <laughs> would be pretty well, I would need a break. So he relies on the dozen or so selection committees, the selection teams, to do this work for him. Again, my name is Will Wright. I'm a freelance journalist and writer. You can find me at writeswords.com. That's W-R-I-G-H-T-S, W-O-R-D-S dot com. If you dug this essay, then please click dig or like and share it amongst your friends. Now, next time, maybe I'll describe the progress I'm making in building or writing a book about mixed-race characters in American movies. Thank you for your time.